came together and prepared a medley of songs just before the Red Nose event itself. Our purpose was to show kindness and appreciation to people, especially cleaners and workers, who were often neglected for what they do. It was priceless to see their faces lit up with smiles as we performed our songs. I want to be a youth who loves God and loves people. Upon reading the Book of Acts, I really think that it is a book written to inspire all of us that anyone can share the love of Christ, anyone can share the Gospel as long as he or she is willing and has the faith to move in the Holy Spirit. And though as young as we may be, God can still use us in a great and mighty way to serve His Kingdom. It is not my first time fasting, but this time is different because youths from City Harvest Church are coming together to fast together and there is this sense of unity. Fasting has brought me closer to God. It allowed me to deepen my consecration towards Him and helped me to be more kingdom-minded. When we begin to pray for revival, one of the things that we need to understand is this, that we must first be touched by God. And as we are being touched by God, being renewed by His fire, as we start to learn to consecrate our life for the Lord and out of that relationship, I believe that revival will begin to break forth. We need to understand that revival is a byproduct of our relationship with God. be an obligation it should always be a delight you know serving the Lord you know must never become a duty it has to be a joy I pray that the young people of City Harvest Church will always place Jesus at the center of our lives he is the center of our lives nothing else matters promise God, you promise you will use City Harvest, you promise you will take Asia by storm, God you promise your glory will fill the earth, you promise your glory will fill Singapore, God we pray God, right now Lord, tonight Lord, send forth this anointing God, send forth revival God, send us all into our campuses Lord. The Lord is looking for those who are loyal, those who are committed to His cause. The Lord is looking among us in this place, a pure heart, a heart without mixture, a heart without agenda, just to worship Him, to magnify Him, to make Him our one and only. Friendship evangelism isn't evangelism if you don't talk about Jesus. Relational soul winning isn't soul winning if you have never led anybody in the sinner's prayer to receive Christ. Because Jesus is still the only way, the only truth and the life, ascending God, sending us to a dying, broken down world to preach the gospel so that our class and our campuses will come to Christ and experience His redeeming love, His renewing and restoring love Come on, give the Lord a big clap. Hallelujah.